you think, man? That's crazy. Is it the same truck? They look different. <laughs> All right, hey, what's going on, guys? I got two new projects at the shop I'm fixing to start. Uh, one's actually a GMC, I want to say it's a Colorado, I believe, uh, and the other one is uh, 90s year model Ford Mustang. So they're both going to be complete color changes. They're both going to be quite a bit of work. The Colorado, I believe, is going to go black, and the Mustang is going to be Nardo gray. So they're both going to be fun projects. They're both going to take a little bit of work, but I look forward to, to seeing what they look like once they come out the shop. So uh, go ahead and tune in, guys. If you haven't subscribed yet, go ahead and subscribe. I highly suggest you do. Like the videos, drop a comment down below, follow me on all my socials, and follow along for the ride. I'm going to pull these around right now and put them over here in the garage door. So I got the body work done on the Colorado. I got it primed yesterday. That's just the first phase of primer. The reason I'm doing it like that is because it is gonna be black. So I wanna make sure that I block it out and get it as straight as I can. So for right now, I put a couple of coats of primer. I'm gonna go ahead and take it apart right now, get all the headlights, grill, door handles, get all that taken off. I'm gonna get it ready and I'm gonna shoot another coat of primer. I'll make sure everything's nice and level and straight. Cause when I go to shoot this, I want the metal to be straight as possible. Uh, I want it to show um, you know, really clean body lines and everything like that. So sometime today I got to weld into row pan so I can get that primed as well. So Quick update on the Colorado. I got the cab in the booth. It's ready to spray. Doors were sprayed yesterday on the inside. So the only thing left at this point to do today is get the cab sprayed, which is the roof, the jams, the fenders. Uh, I think that one of the last things that's left to do is just when he brings in the hood, uh, he's changing the hood from the factory stock hood to the hood with the hood scoop. So
just got off the phone with the owner of the Colorado. He said there's a little bit of a setback on the hood. They were supposed to get it in today, but I guess the freight company must have uh, misplaced the hood. So we're going to go ahead and paint the old hood and uh, put it on there for now. It has a few little dings and stuff, but later on down the road, weeks or a couple of months from now, when he gets the hood in, uh, we'll go ahead and switch it out. But for now, we're going to stick with the old hood. All right, guys, that's gonna wrap it up on the Colorado. Only thing I got left is to get some aerial footage of it to finish all my content stuff. But overall, I'm super satisfied with this project. I hope the client is as well. It was a complete color change from the OEM Silver Birch to the black. Uh, changed out headlights, tail lights, put new emblems, put in a new shave row pan, gave life to the old bed liner, put some new bed liner on the rails. Just overall complete package. Hopefully the client likes it as much as we did. I'm super satisfied with it. I can't wait to get on the next one. So hope you guys stay tuned to the very end. If y'all did, drop a comment down below. Give it a thumbs up. Share this with your friends. And on to the next project, guys. I'll see you on the next one. Later. What you think, man? Is it the same truck? It looks different. <laughs>